Do you know, my friend, there is not one single day that we don't pray with one or more people that are going through a loss of a dear one. And there may be someone that you know that has lost somebody recently. All of us know someone. Sometimes they're very close, though they may be thousands of miles from us. And we know as they go through this time, or when we're going through this challenging time, that there is no separation in spirit, that we're always one with those that we love. There is a great comfort in knowing this when someone dear to us goes through the change that we call death. There is no separation in spirit. We are one with those whom we love, whether they're on the other side of the world or the other side of life. Let us give thanks for all those that have been and who are right now an important part of our lives. And let us think of the great love of God that unites us all. Let us think of the beauty and goodness of life. You know, in John 17, verse 23, it says, I in them and thou in me, that they may become perfectly one. We're always one with those that we love, and I believe that prayer is the language of spirit and that they can feel our love and feel our prayers. Let us resolve to reach out and pray for those that have been such a great part of our lives. Let us thank them, and I believe that they will hear that thank you, and feel that love, and feel and hear that prayer. And let us also, in their memory, let us resolve to reach out and help and enrich the lives of others, just as we have been blessed and enriched by the loved ones that we have had as a privilege in our life along the way. I pray today that you know that there is no separation in spirit. I pray that you know that we're always one with those that we love.